The world is in peril. Never before has it been more important to learn about the traits, habits, and sexual preferences of Mother Nature's beautiful inhabitants. Hello, I'm experienced naturalist Owen Partridge. You probably remember me from previous blockbuster hits like the Animal Facts and taking it out on no! the Animal Facts. Today, we're gonna embark on a brand new adventure to learn about some of the animal facts people encounter in their everyday lives but may not know that much about. You know them from the outside? Let's get to know them from the inside. It's called Animal Facts and it starts right now. <laughs> if you're wondering why I'm whispering right now, it's because right behind me are dozens upon dozens of bloodthirsty birds. Bats are universally known as leathery, troublemaking birds. In fact, bats are often the largest birds on the planet, depending on your altitude and the position of the sun. Do I like bats? No, of course I don't like bats. Nobody likes bats. What's that smell? Why, it's the solitary baboon. That smell can be smelled from a thousand miles away. Baboons are known mostly by their curious shape. This is a rare collection of baboons, called a UN meeting. Like a UN meeting, they get together and pick insects off of each other's hides and feast upon them. Afterwards, they'll return to their respective hotel rooms. No macaws for concern here, only macaws for enjoyment. Macaws have some of the most soothing voices in the animal kingdoms. Known for their voracious appetites, macaws have been the prime suspect in numerous murder cases since the mid 1800s. And yet here they are, brazenly flaunting their horrific past. Why don't you go back to the devil's teat from which you were weaned, you hellacious hellbirds? <laughs> Once again, we learned as much about the animal facts. We encountered some common species and got to learn some interesting facts about their natural history. Most of them smell terrible, some of them look tasty, but all of them were pretty interesting and definitely worth having a show about. I'm your local registered and bonded natural history expert, Owen Partridge, encouraging you take it out on nature.